Hello and welcome to another edition of Beer Dad's Beer Reviews. We're going to do the third beer in this week's four from one from Tartarus and we're going to look at this one here. And this is a Loki and this is a Black Kvike Triple IPA. Um, it comes in at an 11.2% ABV. So again, not messing around today, we're going straight in, high end. Um, give you the tail of the tape on this one so i say 11.2 percent vegan beer which is great the ingredients is barley yeast sugar water hops and yeast hops are ella topaz nelson sorvin and kohatu k-o-h-a-t-u and the yeast is horndal kreich yeast best before is the third of the seventh 2023 and the guide is 71 for those of you who are interested and it is 4.93 UK units it says all that on the back and again there's a little QR code if you want to scan pause and scan or take a screenshot and scan feel free that's the uh, scan this QR code to learn the tale have a little look at this label by the way this is beautiful Loki in the middle there we've got serpent we've got what hellhound Green flames on his hands and a sword in the other. It looks fabulous. Again, as I said, I said on Monday when I did the uh, Demeter, their labels, the Sars's labels, are second to none. They are absolutely stunning, and they are worth <clears throat> getting up as a picture and putting on a wall as a, as a as in a picture frame because they're just gorgeous. Okay, so let's pop a top on this one. See what we've got. Black IPAs. I don't get along with black IPAs. I sometimes struggle with them, with them being sort of, yeah, that roasty toastiness, and then you get the IPA fruitiness. It, it, it kind of messes with my head a little bit. Um, but this might be something a little bit special because it's, as I say, it's a Kvike um, triple. So let's have a little look at it. Look at that there. So there we go. Beer and glass. What have we got? That is a thief. I mean, it, look, it looks black. I would say it's more of a deep brown, a yeah, really dark brown. Um, yeah, it's got a way I'm looking at it, it's got a slight red, red hue to it. Um, we've got an ivory head, half a finger, yeah, half a finger. Let's get the nose so we can smell. Alcohol, you smell the booze on this one. Chocolate, roasted malt. <laughs> Pine, resiny, fruity, a little bit tropical. It's really, it's really, it's really odd for me. Because <clears throat> I look at this, and my brain says to me, "That's a stout. That's a that's a that's a porter. That's a stout." And then I smell it, and my brain's going, "No, it shouldn't smell like that." But it does. It's it's it both of best of both worlds. It's lovely. <laughs> Right, let's go for the budget combination. Cheers. Medium bodied. Light carbonation. Ah, okay. It's lovely. It's really nice on the palate. It's smooth and it's slick. It's a cracker. Let's go for the big taste. Cheers. It's roasted malt and it's dark chocolate. <laughs> but it's a little bit, it is a fruity. <clears throat> it's almost, it feels to me like it's almost tropical. I don't know if it's, it, if it's a stone fruit in there. There's a, there's a, it is a sweetness to it. And then you've got a piney resiny roasted malt dry finish light bitterness well bitter finish you know what it's it's all right it really is it, it, it's okay i've got an alcohol warm and feeling here um which is interesting I 
that's not bad at all. It's just it's messing it's just messing with my mind. I say <clears throat> roasted malt, bit of chocolate, slightly fruity, um, <laughs> piney, alcoholy alcohol burn here, which is, I say it, it's it's warming, I am not unpleasant. I am it's everything. It's it's an IPA, and it's a it's a it's a stout slash porter. Oh, it's messing with me up. But do I like it? Yeah, I do actually. I really do. Oh, so let's wrap this review up because I'm going to bring the rest of this off camera. And no way am I drinking an 11.2% beer <clears throat> in a 440ml can. Um, on this video. So, anyway, this is Tataris' Loki. This is a Black Kavike triple IPA coming out at 11.2%, like I say. This is available on the website. It is a quid. Um, is it worth it? Yeah, I think so. So, if you've had this beer, let me know what you think. Please put a little comment in the comments box below. I will put a link to the Tatars website. As I say, is at the time we record this video, this is on that website. Um, do that for the video. Do that if you don't. Subscribe down there. And I'll see you on the next one. Stay late, stay safe. Drink good beer. Hello.